Today is actually Monday and we are doing another weekly grocery shop. Hey guys, happy fall. So today we are actually at the state fair. I know it don't look like it, but I just wanted to come and introduce the vlog. Just got here not too long ago, taking some bathroom breaks. And as y'all can see, it looks really, really cloudy. And I just hope it does not rain on our head because that would be so embarrassing. This is like the one day out of the week that I was able to make space to come to the fair if y'all don't know anything about me i love the fair it's probably like one of my favorite things to do during the year and i feel like it officially kicks off fall and all the fall vibes i got me some duncan the drink that i'm trying is this toasted almond iced coffee and honestly i would get this again October the 10th and as I seen we did go out and have a cute little lunch at the boathouse. We went to Shore Pump and I had no idea that the Shore Pump location had a boathouse. So like why didn't y'all tell me? Why didn't y'all tell me? Anyway, now we about to get dessert at this place called Cineholic. We found it on Instagram. This is a cinnamon with hazelnut and bananas. Girl, pick up, I'm crawling your phone. Crawling your phone. I'm waiting outside. Be going for a ride. Explore the unknown. Explore the unknown. Anticipating and thinking about when I'ma get you alone. Picking you even if you had a clone. Baby, I'm waving I'm super patrol. Yeah, we made it back home from our little adventure. Okay, so how would you rate the Santa Holic? Six. Six out of ten. Okay, Santa Holic versus Santa Bun. Vote. Eight and a half for Cinnabon. Okay, so Cinnaholic didn't come to deliver like the Instagram girl they said. You can't trust them. Y'all, I don't know if y'all have it where y'all at, but I done took and told you about Seven Brew. Seven Brew remind me of some type of coffee I didn't have before. I cannot quite put my finger on it. If y'all know which one it is, let me know. These are my only PJs, but is it too soon, baby? Y'all can put it on the criminal list. This corn maze didn't have nothing on us. Nothing. We came, we saw, we made it out.
Check look out the window Spirit goes up as the rain falls down I've been sitting on the wrong course Keep it together, look at the we left from the pumpkin patch slash market. Now we are about to get some liner. I don't know. We've been on this liner lately. <laughs> Very late lunch, early dinner, which I like because I usually intermittent fast. So I usually don't eat until after 12 anyway. But it also helps you just have one meal a day. And if you're watching your weight, then eating one time is a good thing. <laughs> I can say it's cute as hell. Y'all look at this fire pit. Okay, so the drinks that we got is the Riptide Rush and the Painkiller. So the purple one has Bacardi Dragonberry, Velour, Flower Extract, Simple Sub, and Lime Juice. And the orange one has Pineapple Rum, Kachaka, Pineapple Orange Juice, Cream of Coconut, and Tiki Bitters. Okay, y'all, this is our second round of drinks. If y'all don't know, we celebrated, baby. Five years, shawty. And she got another one because it was just that good. So, period. Baby mom, can I just be honest? I was only wondering and maybe we could take it to a different conversation. Things will get uncomfortable, but only if we make it. I just want to say that. But you'd rather take it all back. Hey y'all, hey. So we did make it back home and let me tell y'all, them drinks definitely had me on a vibe. I just love our little home. I just love the life that we have created for each other. And honestly, you guys, I feel so, so blessed. I was going through my camera roll and looking at some old pictures. There's this trend going around right now on Instagram. It's like, where you insert the picture of the skinny version of you. So as I was looking for the skinny version of me, I was seeing a lot of my old memories and I just love going back and having those nostalgias, just seeing where it is that I came from and just thinking about those times where it's just like, I would have never thought that this would be my life. I am tremendously blessed in so many avenues in so many ways. And anytime when I lose sight of where it is that I've come, how I have just held resiliency through it all and like all the blessings that's bestowed upon me, the environments, the people, my mindset, how it all has evolved just over this time. It's just one of those moments where I'm thinking like just in a week or so from today, I'm going to be 30 and a half. What have I learned in the six months of my 30s and how can I take that with me? I'm honored for you guys to be here. I'm honored for you all to share this space with me. Um, people who've been here since the very beginning, people who came along the way, I'm just I don't know. This space means a lot to me. And I know I be taking time all just stepping away where y'all don't see me. But trust me, like even in the midst of all that, I'm doing the work. So yeah, <laughs> I just wanted to like come into the vlog and bring that to you guys and just share that with y'all because it's been really heavy on my heart. So if anything resonated with you, definitely give this video a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment subscribe if you haven't considered subscribing already then the button's down there to do so and yeah so i'm about to hop back outside i just wanted to take a moment to check back in with y'all and let y'all know that our liner was chef's kiss